Welcome to this EuroLean Plus video lecture. Today we will explain the concept of period batch control, the first just-in-time system. We will draw major lessons that can be used in modern production planning and control. Period batch control is a more than 80-year-old just-in-time system for production planning and control in high-variety, low-volume environments. Period batch control was developed in England in the 1930s by R. J. Geely. During his lifetime, he installed the method in 30 different factories, but his greatest success was during World War II when he worked in the Ministry of Aircraft Production and used PBC to control the manufacture of Spitfire fighter aircraft. At a time when limited factory capacity and of material shortages, he increased Spitfire output by only making each month the parts needed for assembly in the following month. Let us consider a manufacturing situation with three departments, part manufacturing, pre-assembly, and final assembly. Many manufacturing companies have these departments. These companies may produce final products partly on stock and partly on order. Let us now explain period batch control step by step. We make a matrix showing the three subsequent departments and a time axis. Each cell indicates what has to be done within a particular time period. In this example, we take periods of one week. In reality, companies may use periods of one or two days. In the Spitfire example, a one month period was used. Assume that department one has to perform a number of jobs in week one. In the next week, week two, the parts produced in week one are applied in the subassembly department. At the end of week two, the subassemblies are ready to go to final assembly. In week three, department three assembles the final products, making use of the parts produced in week one and subassembled in week two. Next, the final products can be shipped to the customer or placed into the finished goods inventory. Yellow products have to be finished in week four. It is clear now that the parts needed for these products are manufactured in week two and subassembled in week three. A similar story can be told about the orange products. So, each stage in the goods flow only produces in a period those items which are needed in the next period in the next stage. Important to remember, lean times of the various stages are equal and do not depend on the amount of work needed per item in each stage. Batch sizes are determined by the periodical need, independent of ordering and holding costs. It is a very simple and transparent system. So what are the key advantages and disadvantages of a period batch control system? An important advantage is the transparency of the system. All the jobs that a department works on have to be finished in the same period. Operators know what has to be done and can ask for support if the amount of work is too much. Another advantage is that if the system works well, all input components and subassemblies are available at the beginning of the period with no problems due to unavailability. A disadvantage may be that machines in a department which are needed early in the process are occupied, especially in the beginning of a period, and finishing machines are needed at the end of the period. This situation may lead to the decision to enable a team or department to do some work in advance and to start earlier. Another disadvantage which can be discussed is that the period batch control pushes all components and subassemblies in the same periodical framework. So, components which need long setup times on machines are produced in the same batches as components which do not need any setup time. Here, we have only explained the most simple PBC scheme. More information about PBC can be found in the article Period Batch Control, Classic, Not Outdated, in the journal Production Planning and Control. It is important to remember that the fixed lead times per department or cell supports accountability and increases control options at the work floor. This is an important principle for planning and control in a high variety, low volume environment. Thank you for watching this video on period batch control.